I'm sure lahat ng bumuo ng production ay excited. Um, kahit ako, sobrang excited ako kasi mapaparod na siya ng iba pang tao na hindi pa nakakanood. At uh, maralaman nila kung uh, ano ang mensahe na to, ano ang Orgulo Compound. Lahat ng paghihirap namin, eto na. May kita na nila, bagay finished product namin. May kita na nila ang binuo namin sa ilang buwan. Uh, pero, bukod sa excited ako, ang feeling ko din ngayon ay pagod. Kasi, uh, pero pagod in the best possible way. Ang dami rin pinagdaanan ng Orgulo Compound. Ang dami pinagdaanan ng lahat ng tao sa likod ng show na to. Nakapagod naman kasi talagang pagtayo ng, ng isang uh, theater show. Um, lalo na kung ang setup natin ay hybrid. <laughs> At um, hindi, hindi ganun kadalas ang pag meet namin sa personal. Pagod, pero in a fulfilling way. Siguro fulfillment na lang. Fulfillment. Yun yung naramdaman ko. Um, yun. Um, yung show week na siya, I feel that bittersweet feeling. Kasi on one hand, I'm so proud of the work that we have done and I'm so happy that we are able to give it to the people. But, you know, can we do it all over again? I mean, yes, nakakapagod, nakakaloka mag-prod work. But experiencing this whole production with so many talented people and so many people who are very passionate in what they do, it's, it's so much fun and it's just so fulfilling to see that we are all doing something beautiful for the audience. <laughs> I feel that grabe ang bilis ng panahon. Parang kailan lang we were gathering people to be a part of our production. Right now everybody worked for this to happen and we are on the last leg of everything. Kaya super exciting pa din siya and super nakakatuwa lang na a lot of people are already watching the show and we are getting great feedback from them so it's very accelerating. <laughs> Siguro kung pagiging parte ng production management team ang pag-uusapan bago pa gumalaw lahat ng tao sa production kaming PM team meron na kami mga kinakaharap na challenges. Uh, kinailangan naming mag-schedule ng lahat ng gagawin sa production. Kinailangan naming ihanda lahat ng gagamitin, lahat ng gagawin, lahat ng permits. Kinailangan din naming magharap ng isang buong team uh, para tulungan ang silab na magtayo ng production. You know, we had to find fellow students under the Theater Arts Program. Uh, we have to find them as collaborators who are uh, willing to learn who have the skills to mount a production and also who are willing to collaborate with Sila because it's not just students who are collaborating in this show we also we are also collaborating with professionals ang mga prof professors namin sa Binild um kasi hindi naman talaga hindi madali ang pagtatayo ng production ginawa namin lahat 'yon thinking na kailangan naming mabigyan ng justice ang sinulat ni Doc Layeta at may pakita namin sa inyo ng klaro ang gusto naming sabihin sa mga manonood. The whole hybrid process of online and live production is it's quite a learning experience kasi an advantage that we saw online is that mabilis ang communication but it still is a whole different kind of pagod because of internet fatigue most of us are juggling our studies and some of us have double roles in the production and the production management team really had to like balance our whole lives because we have to oversee each and every department on both online and live so yeah but really all thanks to our very very talented staff who works hard day and night and who are very good at what they're doing we are very very thankful and grateful for all of you but ito na ang face to face sessions who it was quite it was really a challenge kasi due to the pandemic the school has enforced um, strict protocol so with that we lacked manpower sa live aspect so when people say na it takes a whole village to create a production well dito sa orgulho compound isa lang kaming extended family 
<laughs> but all jokes aside, the adjustment from online to live theater, it's um it really is tiring. Cause we got used to creating productions inside our homes for the past two years. And now that we're somewhat back on live theater, we suddenly have to juggle two different processes and we have to know how to adjust on both because different processes are online, different processes are live. So it's kind of overwhelming a bit, you know, but yeah, we made it. Here we are. We made it. <laughs> process natin right now or nung para sa production na to it's very different kasi unlike no makisig and bago tumilim sa labas other than it being just all students we have to plan out this big logistics just to make sure that everything will go well like, kasi since we are in different places in the country so i have to deliver this deliver that so unlike now unlike now na we have dates now we can go to campus and rehearse and make the props and whatsoever. So super kakaiba na naman siya. So we had to ask for permits. We have to double check everything. We had to make sure that everything is in the premise. As a production manager, grabe yung double checking sa process and to make sure na our calendar, our production calendar, will go as planned. Even though, of course, there are mishaps here and there, but still, <laughs> Kasi, yun nga, we have set dates to go to the campus, so we have to reserve that for rehearsals, we have to reserve that for shooting dates. So most of the process for this production is still done online. I realized that this process really geared us into doing something greater. Kasi, we are not just capable of mounting a production online. We are gearing ourselves to building or mounting a production on site. So it really gives us that edge that we get to see the flexibility of theater. So yeah, we get to learn these things in this new process. Nakatuwa lang na we are able to push through despite the difficulties na it is giving. Ayun, ay, it's just a part of it. It's part of the process. It's part of getting to know theater. It's part of learning the whole production process of the theater. And we are lucky to have been doing that system. Kasi, syempre, it gives us that extra knowledge. <laughs> Ang masasabi ko lang sa lahat ng manonood at lahat ng manonood ng Orgullo Compound, sana pagkatapos nating panoorin ng show, mas lumawak pa ang pangunawa natin sa lahat ng tao, sa lahat na nakapaligid sa atin. No? Uh, kakilala man natin o hindi, kaklose man natin o hindi, kahit may mga hindi tayo nagpagkakasunduan, lalo na sa panahon ngayon, magkaroon sana tayo lahat ng lakas ng loob at... Uh, malasakit para kamustahin sila no? magtanong tayo makipuusap tayo ng masinsinan kasi hindi natin alam baka ang kailangan na para ng isang tao na tahimik lang dyan sa isang sulok ay mapakinggan siya maintindihan siya para kapag nakuha na talaga natin ang gusto niyang sabihin o ang gusto niyang gawin alam natin paano siya sasagutin uh, paano siya gagabayan uh, uh, o kaya maliwanagan siya o kaya maliwanagan tayo kung malinis ba ang kanyang intensyon para sa ibang tao o para sa nakararami. Marami kaming naramdaman sa ilang buwan ng pagbuo na to at magandang bagay uh, at napaka necessary sa atin bilang tao ang makaramdam. Binuo namin ang silab para ikwento ang pinagdadaaran ng bawat Pilipino ng isang Pilipino sa loob at labas ng kanyang community, sa loob at labas ng kanyang tahanan, sa loob at labas ng kanyang isipan. Kaya hindi kami makapagkwento ng wala kayo. Kaya sobrang nagpapasalamat kami sa inyo. Uh, ginagawa namin lahat ng makakaya namin para hasain ang aming kakayahan 
para sabihin namin sa inyo ang tamang mensahe o kung ano mang mensahe ang meron ang isang kwento um, at para may pakita namin may paramdam namin sa inyo na hindi kayo nag-iisa at deserve ninyong mapakinggan maintindihan at magkaroon ng boses yun lang my experience as an APM for this production is very fulfilling I mean all of us worked really hard to create this production and seeing it be there out there in the world and people getting to experience Orgullo Compound, our baby, is just so exciting. It's just so, oh, we're very, very happy. So, I mean, the whole hybrid process talaga is very challenging. Pero we all felt that it's so worth it. Kasi even though it's overwhelming, we got to see a marriage between two different two vastly different theatrical processes, you know, online and live. And I think with that, we were able to innovate a different technique that will help us further develop our next productions. So yes, oo, to the true, making a production is, it's hard. It's time consuming. Theater making in general is just, it's such a violent process. I mean, it just makes you want to like scream and cry and laugh at the same time. But <laughs> it's when you know that you're creating something beautiful, it makes everything seem easier. It's just so worth it, you know? So if I were to relive all of the challenges again, I mean, sit through our long meetings again, work our brains out to figure out budget issues, scheduling issues, manpower issues, sticking another hot dog sa stick kasama yung marshmallow all for our production. <sighs> I would gladly do it all over again. So, this is a message for everyone who is yet to watch or who you compound na we hope you appreciate we have built for the last Three months, it um, occupied most of our time and our well-being. But nonetheless, it is something that we are really proud of. It is something that we are very honored to be doing. Lalo that we are, our actors are under the direction of Miss Jenny Loiko Cruz. And we are doing a material by Dr. Langeta Bukoy. As a production manager, I'm just very honored to have been doing the first edition of Orgullo Compound and I hope you guys will be able to pick up a lesson or two in the story itself and you get to know that there is this possibility of mounting a show in this type of modality in the blended moda modality and you just have to believe that theater doesn't end there, theater has a lot of possibilities. It can be a lot of things, and this is one of them. That's that is what theater is all about. Good luck. <laughs>